Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your mid-December uh, 2018 reading. So it's the last reading for the year. Um, happy holidays, happy new year, happy, happy, okay? Um, meditating off camera for you. Uh, some of you are doing a lot of work in your career, which is really good. You'll get some recognition there and probably get some promotion or bonus and you, something you probably already know about anyhow um in love and romance it's like something sliding down or it's like gradually falling down you have to make a decision do you con do you continue or what do you do here so um that's that some of you are still waiting waiting for somebody to do whatever it is they need to do in regards to you in the relationship or lack thereof you also some of you like in separation with someone and that may go for the the party of people who are waiting okay um health issues getting better some of you are really standing strong on cultivating better health for yourself so that's really good um let's get into it let's see all right so i'll do one card for career and finance. Career and finance. Let's go ahead. Whoa! Ace of Pentacles. Nice. Didn't I say some of you are doing some work? Either starting something or you'll be receiving maybe a large sum of money or uh, starting something that can be foundational. This, this is the laying of the foundation so that you can build upon it. A promotion um starting a business uh, of course a large sum of money in regards to your career and finance um it looks good it looks really good uh and we'll pull another card out a little bit later and the next card will be for health and well-being how is aries health and well-being Ace of Swords. All right. Like I said, you, some of you have cut out some things. You've gotten really honest with yourself. You've, you've either had diagnosis or communication about your health, about what you need to do to cultivate better health, to get to that place of a pristine and prime health, whatever that may look like for you. This is very good. Two aces, two new starts. I'm blessed by the heavens, so this is really good. Some of you are just really um, trying to stay direct and um, direct and clear on, on, on each path. All right, so how does Aries spirituality, spiritual, spiritual advice for Aries? Okay, ooh, two cards. Well, okay, the devil and the tower, spiritually. There might be like some stronghold here. For some of you, I'm hearing that it might be like a sexual addiction, maybe something you have not really addressed within yourself because you don't look at it as an addiction. There might be some codependency within regards to spirituality. Like there's some tie here, some lower vibrational negative tie to you fill in the blank. This could be sex, this could be money, this could be food, this could be anything. We're gonna pull another card on that. The spiritual advice. Um it looks like it's coming down or something's getting found out or someone's dealing with something or there's an event that happens in your life that allows for you maybe to transform the energy we'll pull some more cards on those that's some pretty heavy energy to have some of you could be dealing with capricorn or scorpio
it's, it's for some of you the spirit is really trying to help you tear down the stronghold that you really feel that you that this stronghold that you have about you fill in the blank about whatever it could be a person it could be a thing they want you to examine that spiritual that karmic con connection here okay. all right love and romance for aries love and romance for aries okay wow six of cups okay so this could be Oh, sorry. Some of the spiritual advice. Okay, how do I word? Okay, so spirit wants you to break down those negative connections, thoughts that you have towards you've hold you've held them for a number of years. It's all about dealing with the past. It's about dealing with something that um, keeps you bound to. A negative state of mind I'm here never mind okay something here we'll, we'll figure this out and the extended uh, six of cups in love and romance so there might be here cancer Pisces Scorpio it doesn't have to be from the past if someone you have history with someone you may even have children with Someone that's younger than or older than you you choose. Someone who you feel like is a soulmate. They may be coming back. There might be someone resurfacing. Okay. Um, okay. So let's. Where are we? Seven minutes. Let's clarify. And then we'll talk about it. The website. What's the Ace of Pentacles <clears throat> in career and finance for Aries? Ace of Pentacles in career and finance. Wow. Queen of Cups, nice. Uh, something that you are deserving of. Some of you may be starting a business that fulfills you on an emotional level, or there's something creative you're doing. There's something. Uh, spiritual or intuitive um, it could even be something with children ace of sword and health and well being what's the ace of sword and health okay. these two wanted to pop up nice knight of pentacles queen of pentacles the Queen of Pentacles is very much into her health and well-being. And we'll talk about that at the website. Th th that is very, very good. Knight of Pentacles also. Okay. Um, spiritual advice. Spirituality for Aries. Okay. Oh, wow. So it is about maybe two of cups. Okay. And we'll talk about maybe some spiritual advice here. Okay. And love and romance for Aries. Love wants. Okay. All right, Aries. So what we're going to do is go on over to my website, talk about this, clarify even more, and figure out what is the overall advice for Aries. Um, in it you know in an entirety okay all right so aries if you feel like this reading resonated with you uh for you go over to the website and um purchase the extended reading the link is below it's one dollar 75 cent for the extended reading one dollar 75 cent for the extended reading happy holidays um happy new year um purchase merchandise purchase gift cards for the new year um or for the holidays or gift cards just for yourself um yeah i think that's pretty much it for announcements um thank you take care uh 
see you or talk to you in 2019. Bye.